Well, tonight we're learning more about the future of General Motors employees. Yeah, it turns out hourly workers will get profit sharing checks of $10,700, but the pink slips continue to be handed out for salaried workers. Tonight, 7 Action reporter Jim Kirchner is live outside the Warren Tech Center with more, Jim. And we now know the number of layoffs here with salaried employees will be 1,300 and they will get two months of severance. General Motors chief financial officer tells CNBC today no additional cuts are being announced today, but Wall Street says more could be coming. Uh, wage growth and unemployment at a constructive level, all of which point to a healthy U.S. economy. So we may be at a plateau, but it is a plateau at a uh, pretty strong level, and we, we are seeing signs of uh, continued demand, and uh, the truck sales are going well. According to the worker adjustment and retraining notification letter GM sent to the state, this will affect approximately 1,298 salaried employees at the tech center. Beginning Monday, they no longer had to report to work. Their wages and benefits will continue through April the 9th. They may devote all of their time to job search efforts, retraining, other transitional activities. As we've reported, they may not be unemployed long. Some of the good news is some of the skills that are going by the wayside from GM are in high demand all around this region. I'll bet most of those people are going to be able to find jobs. This comes in a year where GM plans to cut 14,000 total employees and close five assembly plants, including the big Detroit Ham Tramic plant, set to close at the end of June. Those are among the workers who will get profit-sharing checks of $10,700 each. And the United Auto Workers Union in a statement says their members get that money because it was in their contract. They're negotiating a new contract with General Motors this summer. Live in Warren, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News. All right, Jim, thank you so much.